this is the Irma Miller Gaming and Body Chair, and it's going to absolutely change the game when it comes to working and playing while sitting at my desk. So in this video, I'll be going through an unboxing, why you should choose Irma Miller Gaming, an overview of the key features, and my first impressions of the Embody Gaming Chair. And Herman Miller Gaming was kind enough to send this chair out to me to be able to unbox and give you guys my thoughts on. So let's taco about it. So the first thing I noticed when the box arrived in my apartment was how massive the box is. That's because the gaming and body chair is shipped pre-assembled. That immediately just checked off a absolutely yes recommendation with this chair. After a long day at work, the last thing I wanted to do was come home to having to assemble a chair and spend hours reading a manual just to mess something up and then having to spend hours and contacting customer support. The unboxing is super simple. You open the box on the dedicated side, remove the packaging, slide the chair right out, remove the plastic protection pieces, and just like that, you have your chair ready to go. And something else I immediately noticed is that because the box is so massive, it makes for a great new place for any cats to explore. In fact, my roommate's cat right now is hanging out on top of the box. But now, why should you invest in such a premium gaming chair? So usually in the gaming market, you can find a ton of racing style chairs. So while a lot of those chairs may look aesthetically nice and fit into your desk setup, they're not always the most comfortable and definitely not the most ergonomic and good for your health. As a gamer, you likely spend hours sitting at your desk and we can all agree that prolonged periods of sitting is definitely not good for your overall health. It's not good for your spine, which can lead to bad posture and overall muscle fatigue and just body fatigue after sitting for so long. So Herman Miller Gaming noticed that a lot of gamers were dissatisfied with their chairs. So that's why they offer the gaming and body chair. The gaming and body chair not only feels very comfortable, it's good for your health while sitting, but also looks damn good. The gaming body's design is something that you don't see on any other chair. It looks like a skeleton on the back. And I personally have the white base with the galaxy colorway. It's got a mix of black, white, and the galaxy looks like a greenish color, which I personally really, really like. Now, some of the notable features that I absolutely love about the gaming body is first the cooling foam on the back and on the seat of the chair. The foam is made up of infused copper particles, which helps regulate body temperature. And the foam has ridges built into it, which helps dissipate heat. Another favorite feature of mine is the back design. It genuinely feels like the back of the chair works with my back and spine versus working against me trying to stand stiff and still. The gaming and body uses a posture fit that helps promote that healthy posture. It helps support the lowest point of your spine while also providing lumbar support. And my third favorite feature is all the micro adjustments that you can make to really make the chair fit for you. You have the back rotating knob that can be used to adjust the tension of the pixels on the back of the chair. The more tension you add, the more upright you feel when sitting. On the left hand side, you do have a handle to allow you to be able to lean back and relax while sitting in your chair. On the front right, you have another knob that can be used to adjust the tension of when you're pushing back on the chair. So increasing the tension with this knob almost feels like the chair is pushing you back up to make sure that you're sitting up straight. Inside this knob, you also have a small handle that can go up and down to be able to increase and decrease the height of the chair. At the front, you'll find two handles that can be lifted up and then pushed forward to be able to extend the size of the seat. This is great for someone who has longer legs or if you have thicker thighs like myself. The armrest can be raised up and down and you can also move them in and out. On the bottom of the seat and on the back of the seat, you'll notice a dynamic matrix of 150 pixels. This allows the chair to evenly distribute your weight, which reduces pressure and encourages movements, which is good for your circulation and so that you can focus on the task at hand. And the chair itself looks and feels very well made and sturdy. It's made up of durable and sustainable materials such as die cast aluminum and glass filled nylon. This gives Irma Miller Gaming the confidence that this will be the last chair that you buy. Not only that, it is backed by their 12 year warranty. So that's an overview of the chair. Now for my first impressions. Honestly, the moment I sat down on this chair for the first time, I immediately felt the difference, not only in the comfort of how comfortable it feels, but also the way the chair immediately made my body, my back, my way I was sitting, sit up straight. It literally felt like my mom or my dad coming to me and saying, stop slouching, sit up straight. And this is what the chair is saying to me right now. After using a cheap mesh chair and then a leather chair for a good while, sitting in this Irma Miller Gaming and Body Chair really told me that I've been sitting in the wrong chair for years. 
and my back is letting me know about it. And as someone who works from home at a typical nine to five job behind a desk, gives me a peace of mind knowing that I have a good chair to sit in while working long hours during the day, gaming at night, or even editing videos at night. And this is something minor, but something I noticed comparing it to my other previous chairs is that the wheels, they're very strong and well-made. I can easily move back and forth, whether I'm sitting in it or if I'm dragging the chair around. And the reason I mentioned that is because I have carpet flooring and it's pretty thick carpet. So sometimes wheels can struggle to move around freely when on carpet, but these, these move nice and freely. Now there are two things that I do wish the chair had. Number one is having the ability to lock the armrest from moving side to side. Sometimes there are moments where I'll grab the chair and pulling it out from my desk and I'll use the armrest and just end up dislocating where I had the armrest. I also wish that when leaning back, you had the ability to lock the chair so that you can stay leaning. But otherwise, I've already mentioned, the chair is very comfortable. And I can see why this has a premium price tag. So there you have it. That's my first impressions of the Ermin Miller Gaming and Body Chair. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have any questions, thoughts about the chair itself, or if you're interested in picking one up yourself, be sure to check out the link down in the description. Hopefully this video was helpful. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and peace.